As a child, I wanted to be a dentist because every time I used to go to the dentist with my mum, I always used to be obsessed with like looking in her mouth and see what was going on. I've never really had a dream job. Um, my background is equestrian and horsey, so probably would have been to go into an equestrian eventing yard. As a child, my dream job was to be a professional footballer or Formula One racing driver. Um, sadly, that didn't come to light. As a child, I didn't really have a dream job. Um, I just wanted a job and I wanted to earn uh, plenty of cash. I've actually developed what my dream job aspirations are, which I don't think is a bad thing. My dream job was to be a professional footballer. As a child, I wanted two jobs. I was a bit greedy. I wanted to find a cure for cancer and at the weekend, I wanted to play scrum half for Gloucester. I'm not sure I had a dream job as a child, but I was always quite keen on teaching and I thought for a long while in my life that I would end up as a teacher. My first job was cleaning toilets in a factory. I had a paper round um, and then I did work in a chippy, which was quite good. My first job was a groom. My first job was working in a grocery store. I worked in a pub when I was studying, which I think is obligatory. My first job when I was at school, I worked in a garage, um, serving petrol very badly. Working in a supermarket warehouse, packing boxes. The most useful career advice I'd probably say is just take the time to consider your options and take a step back. Lead, not just to manage people, um, but also to be proactive in my role and to be passionate about anything that I put my mind to. To not let age get in the way of what you want to achieve. One is always be prepared to make a decision, um, which I hold true to now. And the second one is never turn uh, opportunities to uh, learn more down. Take all the responsibility that you can. There's always some up for grabs. And if you take charge of a situation, then there's a good chance that you will then get an opportunity to impress. Best career advice I've ever had was from my dad. Uh, and he said, just surround yourself with excellence. So when you run a team, recruit the best people you can, um, train them up and give them the freedom to succeed. Their success will be the success of the team and you can just bask in that. Watch the masses and do the opposite.